Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel if you are new or welcome as well. So today I come back <laughs> with an exciting video as always again. I always say that but it's because all the videos are super exciting. So I was on Instagram this day and Neutrogena posted a post um, of this uh, of the product that we're going to review today saying that it is going to brighten your skin. It's gonna be like it's like a brightening um, product. It helps with your dark marks and all that. And you're going to see results as in one week. Like you will see the result in one week. One week, you guys. And I was like interested because I am really interested to see which product is actually going to work in one day because it freaking takes a month, if not three months, to actually see a difference of using like a certain product. So I was like, you know what, let me go and share with my Varanziwa and experience all this with you guys. Okay, so I actually called the store to ask if um, they have the product and they said they don't have it in store. We just finished with the, um, what is it called, with the training about the product. I, I was like, how about I order online? They said, now if you can order, if you order online, you're definitely going to get the product. I did the click and collect option and my box came through. I collected this box. I hope you don't see my address. I collected this box yesterday and I did open. Um, this is actually me after using this product and um, I'll show you how I actually looked like um, yesterday so inside you have your invoice which I'll put there and everything is bubble wrapped and again you guys I bought one product and this box is so big and I wanted to buy the whole set for you guys but this thing is expensive okay so this thing is expensive and I just wanted to just try that one product that I saw and then inside this or like this box I mean I'll give it to them you guys in terms of packaging this is super super nice and I received my order within four days they usually say you would collect within uh, maximum days of three but I they sent an email about riots and stuff I think maybe they were just like in like they're in the middle of it all in terms of deliveries and stuff because my package is from Jovek and I'm not in thing. so um I ordered the Neutrogena Bright Boost uh, Gel Cream. Oh, what is going on? Gel Cream and it looks something like that. I hope you guys can see it clearly. And it's got this pink. Um, it's like shades of pink or blush pink uh, colors. It looks super, super beautiful. It's super girly for people who are girly. This is really, really cute. And I'm not sure if guys, like sometimes you guys, I feel like if a guy wants to use certain products, um, sometimes it's not fair to them to actually use this cute packaging. But because, because I love it, I don't really have much of a complaint. That's me being a little bit selfish. It's written in foreign language this side and this one is in english it said it is developed by dermatologist it is a um, bright boost gel cream for all skin types and also it has neoglucosamine or samine you are, i have no idea and it has ha and phas so um they're saying this product helps activate skin's natural uh, renewal process to target dark spots ah! that sounds like magic to me and fine lines as well as uh, an even skin tone which is something that also excites me uh, for youthfully brighter skin this product is claiming to do a lot of things that I feel like everyone will actually just go and buy I'm not sure whether this product is going to work or it's just another marketing strategy so we're gonna try this for a good week and see if their claims are so correct if their claims are correct so i did a little bit of research about this new glucosamine thing you guys i'm so sorry if i'm not pronouncing it correctly this is supposed to help you with your wrinkles when i check here it diminishes the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles 
while also alleviating discoloration for more even skin tone um it's a building block for skin's natural hyaluronic hyaluronic acid and helps promote firming of the skin which sounds super great so your your AHAs, I think we've, we've spoken about them in our channel, which are your alpha hydroxyl acids. Usually these are the ones that um, that help exfoliate your skin. It helps brighten your skin, um, promote collagen uh, production. And then it helps reduce the appearance of surface lines and wrinkles, promote blood flow in the skin. It helps minimize and correct discoloration. They also help treat and prevent acne and uh, it helps increase uh, up, uh, product absorption, right? So AHA, it's something that we are familiar with. And then there's another one that is a PHA, which I've heard of it before, but I was not really sure what exactly it is so pha is your polyhydroxy acid phas are an exfoliating acid that help hydrate the skin and enhances skin cells regeneration um and they are known to be a little more gentler so when i was checking this product on the clicks website i realized that it's got mandelic acid as well mandelic acid is derived from beta almonds it's an aha that has been mostly started to use with acne yeah this product is just selling me a lot of things like it's giving me hope so mandelic acid is more like a gentler um exfoliating formula which is in this product so anyways this is how um the product is looking if you remember the hydro boost uh gel cream it looks something like this so the packaging is the same it's only the color that has changed so it's got this bottle on top and when you open oh actually i was expecting that you find you see on the hydro boost you find something to open right here like this they've got a lid that protects the what is this the lid and the product itself in between so this doesn't have that so when you open you immediately get the product and it does have the similar smell as the Hydro Boost according to me and this smell gives me uh, Dawn vibes like the smell of Dawn or Top Society if you've been there before so it's giving me that smell which I think it's more like a Neutrogena staple um, smell I'm thinking maybe they also did put perfume so this is not fragrance free I will just check that but it does have like a scent which feels like they did actually put fragrance if you're someone who is on the fragrance free um journey this is one thing that i don't really like about neutrogena products most of them they are really fragranced and thank god with the hydro boost they actually came up with a range that is actually fragrance free so i was wondering if someone is going to struggle with acne and they are they want to uh, remove their discoloration you are probably dealing with something very sensitive and maybe it might not cover for everyone who has sensitive skin and is allergic or sensitive to perfume or um this good smelling product so anyways this is how the product is looking and it is super creamy let me just apply it at the back of my hand so this is how it's looking so this is um day two of me um using the hydro boost so on my first impression you guys it was that um it is not super moisturizing as the um hydro boost or any moisturizer for that matter even my e45 cream so now i'm just going to wash my face and show you guys how it applies on my skin Whew. okay i just washed my face and this is how my face is looking right now so i'm not gonna go in with the serums that i normally go with for a week so i'm not gonna do that for a week so um let's just apply this product so you guys today is the second day I am using this product and my first impression because I wanted to tell you as I apply this my first impression is it gives this pink um it's like a um, pink it's not glitter but it's got like a highlighter sort of effect of this product and again I realized that um when I woke up in the morning I could literally scratch um the product out um product out even yesterday after some time i actually could scratch it out but in terms of applying it really really it dissolves into the skin real quick 
I normally use E45 more especially this winter and it takes me a lot of time you guys to blend that one and this one just glides in um really really great yes it i feel like it gives a person that like glow and again it doesn't really feel tacky but it does like stick to my skin a little bit and one thing that i realized about this yesterday is that it dries super quick on my skin and again i felt a little bit dry i don't know i i don't know whether i'm supposed to go in with moisturizer on top i feel like this can be good as like you gel underneath a moisturizer if you have like dry skin but if you've got oily skin i think this can work just as it is but for someone like me more especially during winter i get to be a little bit dry i just feel like i want to go in with a moisturizer on top because i feel like it is kind of like sucking out the oil in i mean out of my skin and i don't know if it's the actives that I, they put inside or not so anyways this is how my skin is looking just right after applying this hydro boost and i didn't have to use a lot and i feel like um, today because i used a little bit i don't have that caking so let me just see how my sunscreen applies and my sunscreen it's going a little bit rough but it is going it's not gliding as it used to glide i'm gonna wait for some few minutes and see whether i'm gonna experience that or not guess what look at this guys <laughs> for a product that i got for 200 rands why do i have to go through this like why do we still have products that do this oh my especially for a product that i bought for 200 what the hell is this like please don't do this to me okay guys i'm just gonna show you some slides from day one up to day seven so i used natural light to film these footages and some days were sunny and some days were cloudy so some footages will look slightly orange than the other he got me high above like the sun by the moon he's a star baby i'm lighting up like a fool it's true it's true he's making me blow my mind look you guys i tried to apply this product in many ways that i could and the rolling just couldn't stop and it was annoying the hell out of me like i was super super angry at this product i couldn't even apply makeup like my makeup was cakey i had to go and wash my face and make sure that you know i start all over without applying this product because i could literally see it beneath my 24 hour wear foundation like this product um i don't know you guys like it's just annoyed it's day me seven and i'm just gonna pick that much i have been like really guys struggling to I've been struggling to find a way to actually apply this so now I just like pat it into my skin because I don't know how to get this thing not to roll on my face because this is super rolling you are like and pat it in so here is this side and the side i'm so sorry guys i'm not sure if i'm gonna review the other products within this range and maybe they probably work i'm not sure but my honest thought is that i didn't really see any difference within one week as they claimed i feel like it's just another marketing strategy and again i feel like they need to change their formula in terms of whatever they put that is making this thing roll but anyways that is it for my final thought i don't have anything else thank you so much you guys for watching and i'll see you guys on the next one. bye